2009 was the deadliest year for Afghan civilians since the U.S.-led invasion in late 2001. The U.N. statistics show in the year 2,412 civilians were killed in violent incidents, up by 14 percent from 2008 when about 2,118 deaths were recorded. 1,630 of the deaths were caused by the militants, while 596 are said to be killed by the foreign troops. Another 186 civilians were killed in violence, not attributable to the conflicting parties. Over half of all of last year's civilian deaths were caused by roadside bombs and by suicide bombers uh, 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 attacking in uh, civilian population areas. Last year was also the deadliest for foreign forces, with 520 deaths, up from 295 for the year before, as the insurgency escalated and spread from the southern provinces where it began. Civilian casualties are a sensitive subject in Afghanistan, with U.S. forces frequently accused of killing non-combatants in air strikes. The civilians that have created a wave of anti-U.S. sentiments in the war-torn country. Over the past two weeks, Afghanistan has been the scene of mass anti-U.S. protests with calls for the immediate withdrawal of the U.S. forces from the country. We're concerned about the conduct of uh, nighttime search operations, uh, which often have lethal outcomes for the civilian uh, population. Uh, we're also concerned uh, about uh, uh, cultural sensitivity and ensuring that the military forces respect Afghan cultural sen sensitivities. Most of the civilian casualties, especially by the U.S. and NATO forces, took place mostly in southern and western parts of Afghanistan. On May 5, 2009, about 140 civilians were killed when U.S. planes bombed Balabluk, a village in western Afghanistan's Farah province. The U.S. forces bombed this village after they became involved in a firefight with the Taliban militants. This attack sparked a nationwide anger and prompted President Hamid Karzai to demand a halt to air strikes in residential areas, but his demand was not fulfilled. And more civilians were killed by air raids in the course of the year. Civilian casualties have now turned to the biggest concern for Afghan people. Many here warn that militarism will further take roots, and more civilian casualties are expected as Afghanistan is facing imminent deployment of U.S. troops. Fires Khushit, Press TV, Kabul.